it's not included in the exercise but you can also add some general notes so I have here a drafting page with some general notes and you can create a page like this by going to the view tab and click on drafting view if you do that you'll create a drafting view so normally this is place place a, a drafting sheet for details or view for details or maybe general notes if you copy text from a pdf file it will maybe come in like this and you need to do some formatting it might uh, you can also do this formatting in uh, word so you can place the P, uh, pdf text or notes in your windows word uh, application and then make the uh, necessary arrangement like a bullet list otherwise if you do this you can simply uh, create a text tx is a shortcut and then paste the text and then edit it after so if i'm editing it you can simply do the same editing here or in word okay so for example here oops just need an enter key there so you're you're simply doing an uh, text editing now you can add a bullet list okay a dot or a numbered bullet like so and then here just finish up so we'll just say up to here dimensions okay and Let's just say here, I'm not going to follow that, just to show you an example. Let's say for this particular line here, you want it indented, so you can do that. Okay, oops, I need to hit enter first. Let me bring this back. So that's number two. And then you have an indentation, okay? And you can always do that as needed. Okay, so you can use forward indent or bring it back. Okay, so let's just say here, I want to further indent this, so I can do that. And that is controlled by your uh, tab distance. So I, if I go back here, so I'm using 4mm and I edit this type, Notice that the current uh, tab size is 12.7. If I change this to let's say 30 and hit apply, okay, the indentation will go much more. Okay, so I'll just bring that back to 12.7. So you can always change that as needed so that it will look really nice okay you're not it's not too far from the bullet list uh, numbers or too uh, close okay i click okay so you can always create add your general notes and normally you place it you can you can place this anywhere you can place it in your floor plan or if you want a whole sheet with simply the notes